I just want to read a very important verse here about the worldwide idolatry issue. <clears throat> and here is the mind which hath wisdom. The seven heads are seven mountains on which the woman sitteth. These seven mountains being the seven continents of the world, yes, on which Ishtar, the whore of Babylon, yeah, representing idolatry, yeah, uh, this is the new worldwide religion, uh, Hollywood, um, and she sits on each of these seven mountains. Okay, fact. Additionally, as it says in that verse, um, that the seven uh, heads uh, are mountains, the seven mountains upon, the upon which the woman sitteth, then when it says that mountains and islands will be moved out of their place, it means continental shift, as I said earlier. Yeah? If these are mountains on which the woman sitteth, then a mountain moving out of its place will be a continent moving. Earthquake. Yeah? Or separate North and South America. Because this is where, right here, in fact, Colombia and Ecuador, right here, this is where we have had one of the largest earthquakes in world history. I'll just find it in my book. I think it's an 8.9 magnitude. Let me just find that. Confirm it. It's in the earthquakes. So penny. Eight point six. One of the greatest quakes of the twenty first century. Eight point six on the Richter scale. Yeah? Colombia and Ecuador, right across there. Now yeah. Yeah, I mean it's Might be a, a, a bit of a long shot that, but it most likely a place I think for something like that to happen. Um, yeah, yeah. And why will God do this? He's going to leave these guys all on their own to get obliterated. Yeah. Goodbye, America. You guys can move out of the way. Boom. <coughs> Look at this thing. Look at it. Right, if these two superpowers join forces, yeah, China's the most uh, populated country in the world. Uh, <coughs> combine that with Russia, yeah, and India, yeah, or all of the East. It's, it's not going to be East versus West, okay? Because they're, they're going to be obliterated. Uh, it, it's just going to be East taking over the world, gradually. Now, I know a lot of people say Rome and the Pope and all roads lead to Rome. We're beyond Rome. Okay, look at this. We're beyond Rome. Yeah? How on earth is the Pope going to amass an army of millions and take over the world? Do you realise how ridiculous that sounds? <clears throat> Throughout history, the Antichrist has always captured the Pope, like, as with Napoleon, and destroyed the church, okay? <clears throat> and that's exactly what he's going to do again, yeah? And, as I said in my other video, 
Think of the bigger picture, yeah? Look at the bigger picture. <coughs> this is it. There will be three superpowers in the end. I, I'm not going to call these guys a superpower because uh, they're reckless. And well, if they if they if they did manage to um, deploy these and get a hold of these and start using them, then. Uh, uh, they, they, they won't be a superpower for long. They'll just be... Uh, they'll, they'll wipe themselves out. They'll wipe themselves out. Um, the three superpowers being the Red Dragon uh, of China uh, and, and Russia. European Union, the Empire. And the USA. By the way, this is the end time book you want, okay? It's... Jericho, Countdown to Oblivion. Uh, I wrote this um, and published it, self-published, earlier this year on my birthday. And uh, it's, it's got everything you'll need to know uh, about end time prophecy. Um, it, it's not just a prophetic book though. Um, it's, I mean, it's called Jericho. It's about the Battle of Jericho in the Old Testament. Um, so I'll go over that as well. But as I was researching into Jericho, uh, I realised how prophetic it was. The Seven Trumpets. And uh, the parallel of the Seven Trumpets from the Seven Angels in Revelation. Uh, so I ended up reading Revelation a lot as well. Um, and interpreted most of it. Uh, I, 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 didn't, I deliberately haven't interpreted all of it because I think there are some parts where you just have to say no. I, we can't really go there. Yeah. <clears throat> but as for everything on this map, this is already underway. So it's safe to go here. Um, it's not safe to point fingers at the Pope. And although, yeah, the, the beast is still, we still, still shouldn't be pointing fi fingers at President Obama. Uh, yeah. So. That's why I, I've done all of this. This is all supported by science, okay? Scientifically this happens. Um, this could happen. This is going to happen. Um, may not be immediately, might be a while, but uh, yeah, it, it, it will happen. Um, uh, it's supported by current affairs, yeah? And, yeah, Bible prophecy, Bible prophecy.